Pika City Council heard an update this evening on the status of its work ahead of the Polk Quincy Viaduct Rebuild Project. Our Alex Carter is back from the meeting tonight with the latest update for us. David, utility relocation efforts are underway in downtown Topeka in preparation for the larger Polk Quincy Viaduct reconstruction project. It's going to be a major impact to folks, businesses, commuters. Uh, we wanted to break that down as simply as we could, get everybody um, aware, alert that some big projects are coming and uh, what we need to do, what the city's doing as our part uh, to prepare for KDOT's larger work with the Polk Quincy uh, relocation and, and reconstruction. Director of Utilities Sylvia Davis says the city revised its plan to relocate sanitary sewer, storm sewer, and water utilities that are in the area of the via. So we have a redesign and then we broke it out into smaller projects that were a little bit more manageable for folks uh, and, and get some more competitive bids. So by doing that, by taking that approach, we were able to knock that cost down by almost $30 million. Davis hopes the multi-phase project can be completed in a year. In the meantime, she says Topekan should plan for plenty of construction downtown. We will be really kicking off and working fast and furiously through 2024. So you'll see steady construction through 2024, a lot of traffic detours and rerouting, um, different parts of downtown impacted. And then that will extend into the beginning of 2025. Uh, we really hope to be done by the end of January, but that may extend into spring a little bit more. She says construction plans must be carefully coordinated when accounting for the magnitude of the utility relocation project. I think I said that in the presentation, 6,000 plus feet of water line that we're relocating, um, over 7,000 feet of sewer line, and then additional 2,000 feet and more of storm sewer. So a lot of infrastructure that we're touching. And the city developed a website dedicated to its relocation efforts. We have a link online. Alex Carter, thanks for the update.